Good morning, little spirits. It's Sunday, June the 27th, and we have a very wonderful story in the gospel today. And um, it's a little girl that is very, very, very sick. And we can see in the picture Jesus reaching out to her. So let us get started. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Well, last week, we remember we were talking about the water and the storm that Jesus calmed? And I talked about troubles and how we need to turn to Jesus. Pray and trust. Have faith, right? And we can... Worry does nothing. That means we just don't trust God. So today we're going to talk about a very special story. And it's about a little girl. And her dad is coming out to see what we can do if Jesus can help her. So it is the Gospel according to Mark. A large crowd had gathered around Jesus when a man called Jairus came to him and pleaded, Master, my little girl is dying. Please come and take her in your arms so she will be well again. Notice that Jairus isn't saying, maybe you can make her well. Come see if you can help her. No, he says, take her in your arms so she will be well again. And Jesus set off with Jairus, but on the way, a servant came and told them that the little girl was already dead. Now Jesus turned to Jairus and said, do not be afraid, just trust me. Let me say that line again. Do not be afraid, just trust me. I want you to memorize those words. Let's say it one more time. Do not be afraid, just trust me. The next time you are scared, you can just say, I am not afraid, I trust you, Jesus. Jesus, I trust you, okay? So at the house, everyone was crying and feeling very sad but Jesus told them don't cry the little girl is not dead only sleeping then they made fun of Jesus they knew the difference between someone who was sleeping and someone who was dead sending everyone else away Jesus took Jairus and his wife and the disciples James John and Peter up to the room where the little girl lay gently taking her hand Jesus said quietly, little girl, get up. The little girl got up and walked around the room. They were all so amazed that they didn't know what to say or what to do next until Jesus said, give her something to eat. She must be hungry. Wow. Now Jesus was asked by Jairus, help his little girl and when um, someone asked Jesus when he was here on earth and when we ask him today he never turns him down he always hears us and he always comes to us and he knows what's best for us and whatever we ask of him you know, he will do the right thing. Sometimes we don't get exactly what we want right away. Sometimes we get it later on or something. We sometimes something different happens. But know that God always answers prayers. He always hears you and he always brings you peace. And he knows what is best for us, even if we don't understand, right? Now, Jairus was very, very scared because his daughter was very close to death. And on the way to his house, someone told him his daughter was dead. That must have been devastating, right? But Jesus tells him, right? He says, um, um, do not be afraid, just trust me, right? Sometimes things happen and we just have to trust. When they got to the house, they went upstairs and Jesus made her well. So boys and girls, we, end of time will be raised from the dead to go with Jesus so when you have trouble or you're afraid do not worry do not allow fear to take charge 
just tell Jesus you trust him and pray and just let it go okay I know that's hard to do sometimes but it's a good thing to learn and I hope that you have a wonderful day God bless